Our action for you today comes from North London, from the Emirates Stadium, the home of Arsenal. The visitors from uh, just across the capital, southwest London, Chelsea. It certainly revs up the fans when these two London rivals go head to head. Yeah, so much talk leading up to this match. Both managers just uh, having their say, maybe trying to wind each other up. Let's see what we uh, have out on the pitch now. Well, these two players, perhaps we picked out as the likely candidates to keep a special eye on, Alan Smith. I love watching this pair play. They haven't disappointed this season. They've been the most threatening players for me, for both their teams. This is the Arsenal lineup. Martin Odegaard starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the park. And they're going to go with one striker up front. Here's the Chelsea lineup. So we think it's going to be 3 5 2, Alan, don't we? Yes, it looks that way. I mean, this formation went out of fashion for a number of years, particularly in England, but a few managers prefer to bring it back now. Great excitement here as the game gets underway between Chelsea and Arsenal, a real London derby. Thomas. Here's Zinchenko. Can find some space here on the flanks. Change of direction, infield. Saw the ball, went for it. Koulibaly. Now James. N'Golo Conte. Loftus-Cheek. Conte. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. And here's the shot. That will go down as a routine stop. Alexander Zinchenko, Granani Chaka. Here's Zinchenko. Thomas slipping it through. Got a space for him. Now out on the wing. Now the shot. The safe hands from the goalkeeper there. Not the most demanding save, but it had to be made. Yeah, easy though to take it a little easy. Take your eye off the ball. Conte. Ruben Loftus cheek. Could whip it in from here. Looking for teammates in the middle. Good power in that punch away by the goalkeeper from the cross. This is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. Couldn't keep it in play, it's gone out for a throw. Thomas. Now Martin Odegaard. That's gone out for a throw in. the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Arsenal very stable in many ways. The uh, USA ownership seems to be sure of what it wants from the club and there's a, a lot of dignity still at Arsenal. Oh yes, they run things in a certain way. And as you say, I know there's a bit of dissatisfaction about absentee owners and all the rest of it. At the end of the day, they want to see success on the pitch. And shoots! Oh, no scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time. Hung on to the ball well. Thomas. Granny Chaka. Chaka. Odegaard. For White. They can push up Arsenal now from a wide position. 
bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Chelsea attacking here. Chaka. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. Chelsea given the advantage rightly by the referee. Now this is an interesting attack. Referee says free kick. And now he's going to sort out that earlier incident and book the player who committed the foul. Yeah, he doesn't miss much, this ref. He's, he's eagle-eyed and uh, he wanted to give the team a chance to move forward, but always oh, going to produce the yellow for that. Just going to be a talking to. He's not reaching for a card. He's quite lucky there. Fortunate, to say the least. He seems to be lining up for the shot here, Martin, from this distance. Well, he might have bitten off more than he can chew from that distance with that free kick. Yeah, it's a wild one. He lost his shape there. For White. Odegaard. That is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. Tackle goes in. Alexander Zinchenko. Thomas. Now Martin Odegaard. Well, they are clubs from uh, the capital of England, London clubs. But there are other rivals, of course. But it's not the derby for Arsenal is it but it's certainly a, a special game and a special game for Chelsea yeah I think for Arsenal it's a great barometer of where they are and what kind of season that they'll have if they can beat a Chelsea team and the referee is given the free kick He's normally good from these set plays, and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. Chelsea have done it. They've made the breakthrough here. There hasn't been too much to separate these sides, but there is now. Didn't he get it right? The leap, the plotting of the trajectory as the ball came in, and the contact with the head. Well, when you can do that, when you can jump like he can, he's such a strong player. Very hard to stop. So it's Chelsea in the lead. Chelsea, number five, Germani Chaka. Here's Zinchenko. Chaka, Odegaard. Now Thomas. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. Breaking infield. Shot up. Not really tested the goalkeeper, but sometimes it can look a bit too easy. He made sure he made the save confidently. Yeah, he did, and he doesn't make too many mistakes, this lad. This is a very close match. Chelsea have the lead at the moment, but that by no means is a certainty that they're going to go on and win it. You can see what he was trying to do, just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide, but it's gone out for a throw. Oh, it's a corner by uh, that deflection. Quick look at the goal again. Well, straight off the meat of the forehead, and that's flown into the right-hand side of the goal. A short corner. Sterling. Can he clear his lines now? Well, then it goes. He's hit the frame of the goal. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. 
that little bit of daylight that they were after. He took a chance to get in there, and the ball just fell perfectly for him. Couldn't miss from there. No, he couldn't. Point blank effort. But uh, you have got to be in the positions, haven't you, to miss them? The old saying goes true. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Jaka. The referee has indicated to ooze around the uh, crowd for a three minute add on, which is what we're going to get for added time. Room for Chelsea to attack now. Going forward well. And in it goes towards the far post. Good safe contact by the goalkeeper to clear it. Well, that's half time. And Start of the second half and Chelsea are leading here. It's unlike him really to play the ball straight to the opposition. White. Careless there. And they've got it away from the danger. And it will be their throw. Alexander Zinchenko. Odegaard. Now Thomas. Gabriel Jesus. And hit, saw the goal and went for it. Struck the post here. I wonder whether the keeper afterwards will claim he'd got that one covered. Thiago Silva. Loftus cheek. Stopping the pass getting through with a good piece of anticipation. There's good progress with this attack. And then the goalkeeper can maybe think about starting an attack. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. That was a good first 45 minutes. Some of the runs he made were really impressive, and a goal led to one of them, of course. Just needs to keep it up now, keep up that work rate. That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Clever ball. Needs to stay cool now. Shot up. The keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. He's cut it back looking for a teammate. It's a fine stop, but full stretch from the keeper to turn that aside. Conte. Loftus cheek. Not a good challenge by the defender. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. for White Arsenal couldn't keep it coming on strong and looking to play their way through now now Thomas well that's not so much an interception as a poor pass trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here Can really get at the opposition here. He's aiming for the front post. And the header scores! Great power with the header. Excellently placed. Fine goal. He's always on the move in the box, this lad. And we know he's a fine header at the ball. He showed it there. How about that for a goal? But coming in from the right, that was so invited. Wonderful delivery. Great ball, great goal. Let's see the replay now.
to say it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Gabriel Jesus. Time for the substitutes, I think, for Chelsea. Ruben Loftus-Cheek. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. With Kalidou Koulibaly. Ungola Conte. Loftus-Cheek. Quick change of possession here. Gabriel Jesus. He's got his shot off now. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. The officials are a bit concerned with the heaviness of the rain half an hour or so ago. They're always concerned whether the ball can be moved freely and whether it's safe to play in that respect. Yeah, but I think all the fans, some of whom were getting a bit wet, they love to see it, the sliding tackles coming in on a, a slick surface. Very weak challenge. It's a weak cross, really, not getting past the first defender. Jorginho, he can cross it now. It's definitely a foul, where was it? Been given outside the penalty area. Referee's shown the card, it's yellow to the Arsenal man. Yeah, and uh, the referee's angle was perfect, he had a great view. Genuine attempt to go for the ball? Yeah, it was a, a forwards tackle in many ways, a poor one. Chelsea about to make at least one change. Well, they've got to get this wall right, Martin, because he can be deadly from this range. Wonderful save. Had to really reach out for that. Corner to be taken. A short corner. Neatly intercepted. Well, I like the look of this attack. Saw the ball, went for it. Gabriel Jesus. Crafting the through pass. It was a promising situation. They could have made more of that. Four more minutes. Pass, pass, pass. And the player with the ball has so many options. So they work so hard off the ball to make those options possible. Yeah, and it's not being the pass threaded through. So the corner about to be taken. Some activity on the Chelsea bench. Coming into the pitch, number 17, Matteo Kovicic. In goes the corner. Well, that's good defending. That's a good advantage from the referee. The fourth official has indicated... Added time coming up. There will be two minutes of it. Two minutes of added time. Kovacic. And shoots! It's a drive of some power, but off target. Yeah, I'm lucky. Didn't quite get set for that one. The Chelsea fanatics are flying today, and the team's been pretty good too. Oh. And the final whistle has gone, and Chelsea have the victory here.